Okay, people, so it has arrived. My computer, well, yeah, the computer has arrived. Literally just got it from the mail. I'm gonna grab my scissors wherever I put them. I forgot where I put my scissors. Well, I'll use sick ram. If seal's broken, check contents. Well, sick ram works well. Come on. There we go. Like a boss. There we go. We're all open. And it's paper. It's paper. And you can't you guys can't see that. I'll zoom in. There we go. You got I zoomed in a little bit there. Hey hey, what's up? Bubble wrap. A power cord. The the the, the computer itself. Dang. It's actually bigger than I expected. Oh dang! Hold on a second. So Fox is going down. Yay, not good. Guys, I was actually expecting this thing to have a um, a Pentium 4, the older model, where it had the old Intel inside thing. But no, if I pick it up, because this thing is so light, I have to turn on my flash. Hold on. And it says Pentium 4 HT, so it's actually a newer model, Pentium 4. Alright, so... Check it out really quick. Um, ports on the back. Holy crap, lots of USB ports. Six USB ports. VGA, PS2, audio, parallel printer, and serial. This is actually my first small form factor computer ever. It's got a Windows XP Professional, HP, so it should boot straight up. But I'm trying to find how do I undo this the cover. Unless there's a latch. Yeah, there's a latch here. And, and there we go. Oh, oh, it go. I don't even know how to get this. Oh, oh, it comes from. Oh, the front. Whoa, damn. It's in relatively good shape. It just needs a blowing. I know not in that way. It just needs a good blowing out with um, the air compressor. Let me undo my camera from the tripod. Turn my flash. There it is. I'm. Oh. Hmm. The heatsink may have got cut. Oh, it's got six pin power. Here's the plastic thing. Oh, God. This thing's going to need a good blowing out. Oh, oh, there's the hard drive. Yes, perfect. We've got a really good drive in here. And we've got the SCSI drive over here. Um, what else? The 4 gigs of RAM. Little itty bitty fan. Another fan. It's got an internal speaker, so that's really cool. I'm actually going to check on my Dell uh, 330 over here because I had installed XP on, over it, um, over 7. So that's installing updates. So in the meantime, first things first, we're gonna go blow this out, and I'll be right back. Okay, so after a quick, uh, quick blowing, we're gonna get to upgrading this thing. So this one, which is running XP as well, it's gonna get shut down as long as it's not updating. Oh, it's gonna take forever. Never mind. I was gonna say because it's no, it's only on 18 out of 181. So we're gonna do it on a monitor over here. So be right back. Yeah, the main reason I want to test this is because I don't want to have a DOA. A DOA. And I've got it sitting on this very, very sturdy tripod. 
sturdy. So let's plug this in and test it, shall we? Okay, so this is the real test. I've got my camera zoomed in, so no. Real test, we're all plugged in. It's, it should have XP, but we're going to put 7 on there later. So here we go. Man, I've got everything hooked up, so smoke test! Is it on? It's on! F3, F11 for recovery. Ah, Windows Crap Edition, as I like to call it, but it's really Windows XP. Make sure to do. I'll be right back. I, well, no, we can wait. See if this works. Oh, that's that's cool. Dang, the internal speaker is actually pretty darn sh darn good. Okay, it's the oh, this may be a s my my mouse is not working. There we go. It's all updated. This looks like an an OEM copy. Yeah, it's an OEM copy of Windows XP. Alright, so... HP that. Let's make sure everything's identified here. Wow. Let's see what the display says. My mouse is not working again. I've got a bad mouse, that's why. Why is my mouse working? There we go. And my mouse has died. I think my right mouse button is dead. Recovery Media Center? Well, considering that I don't really have a DVD, well, a CD, because this is the only DVD ROM, we can't do that right now. So I'm going to actually grab my other mouse on, the, on this computer here. Uh, so this should be here. Move it. Bam. I'm gonna set my camera down for a second. Grab this. I'll just plug it into the front USB port. Alright, perfect. It saw the mouse. So we're straight in here. Let's see, display. It's got an Intel. I'm out. Let's see. Um. Oh <laughs> uh, well, it looks like everything is in here, right? It's a fresh OEM copy. I'll be right back. My dogs are going nuts. Okay, so this is actually really good so far. Let's check out some of the different backgrounds. Oh, it's just in different resolutions. Oh, this is awesome. It's a stock copy. It, it's not all the way updated, so we're going to slap in my trusty Wi-Fi adapter here. Oh! Glitch much? What is this? Let's try that again. <clears throat> Plug that in. Let's install that driver. A disc here. I've got a little dog. Mm-hmm. All right. So let's see if two tests to see if this disk drive works. Found new hardware. What is this doing? Um, Windows, Raw Link. <laughs> well, it's not that much of an air sucker, and with a Pentium 4, it's actually running reliably. Install. It's installing the Wi Fi driver. Please wait. No, 
let's see what's on the taskbar here. So we got the Intel thing. HP Mac. What's this? Oh, apparently there was a keyboard that came with this, but I have one sitting on the couch over there that I have to bend a pin in, so we're going to do that later. Sound that. Oh, it's got sound max integrated audio. Perfect. And then wi Wi-Fi. My taskbar froze up. But what we're going to do is we will be upgrading this to Windows 7. Well, I will, because I don't want to bore you guys like I did yesterday. No, I don't want to restart my computer. Ah, whoa. Connect. Not my Dang, it's like a stock OEM copy. Let me look. HP Recovery. Recovery, what is this? Okay, then. It's Recovery Partition. We're in here. We're going to go into Windows Update because everything's not updated yet. Google Toolbar. Oh, damn. No, I don't want Google Toolbar. I never did like any toolbars. Apparently, it, was, it wasn't updated because it's asking me for the first time, do I want to install the software? I'm going to actually get this out of here. Disable. Yep. Uh, disable. Um, okay. What we're going to do is we're going to slap in a 100 gig hard drive. I'm going to keep the regular 880 gig hard drive and because recovery. So I'm going to keep it, but we're going to slap in the um, uh, la, la, la. 100 gigabyte one, but I don't want to bore you guys with that. But this is the machine. It's actually pretty darn sure good. So um, that was this video. Uh, Till next time, Alex B is out. Peace.